cracks thing. Yeah. What is this ridiculous? Girl, just three hundred dollars on a Monday afternoon. Like, what is this? You I just struggled for like 15 minutes trying to get my camera to focus and I remembered that Bryce dropped it a couple of days ago and it literally just was out of focus. I just had to move my focus ring a little bit. <laughs> and I'm so drove because I just waste so much time. But what's up you two? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Jamaya and if you're returning, real, rather, die. In today's video, you guys are going to be preparing for the week with me now. This is usually what I do on Sundays or Saturdays, but today's Monday and the weekend was epic, epic. Oh my God, hectic. And I was extremely tired the week before. So here we are on Monday doing things for this week. So um, so I'm going to read my agenda to you guys. First things first, uh, you know, my regular reminder, this YouTube shit is full time now, baby. I'm filming now, okay? So check that off with the reminders okay <laughs> um the second thing i need to do is plan some content and i'm pretty much already have content film i'm just going to go ahead and decide what content i'm going to be uploading during this week and i also need to get a little bit more clear because i told y'all you know that i have to make my youtube and my instagram like you know coincide with each other is that how you say that i need to make them cohesive so um i just need to be a little bit more clear about the type of videos i'm going to do on youtube because my vlogs are doing good and i, I see my vlogs are doing better than my talking videos so i'm going to have to get more clear about what i want to do when it comes to my talking videos or how i'm going to bring that aspect of of wellness to my channel to you know make things correlate but um yeah, that's number two. Number three is I need to go shopping. I'm going to probably hit a couple of stores. Hopefully, I can get everything I need from Walmart. I do need to do a little bit of shopping. Um, I need to get some summer clothes for Bryce, which I should have been dead, but it's cool. So, I need to get some summer clothes for Bryce. I need to get a few groceries and small stuff like diapers. Uh, his The owner of his school just let me know that he needs almond milk, so I'm going to have to get him some almond milk. A um, couple of the small things for groceries. Water, vegan yogurt, strawberries, blueberries, fruit, and possible nuggets fries protein bananas you know stuff like that so yeah hopefully i can get all of the things i need from walmart i also need to go ahead and put some dime tap on this list because he is almost out of his night and morning dime tap so um yeah hopefully i can go to a walmart and get all the little things i say hopefully because the walmart that i usually go to caught on fire and the sprinklers went off and it was this whole thing and now the store is still closed and i have to go to another walmart and i don't know what they're gonna have there um if not i can probably go to like uh i don't know i've never been to target and i kind of want to go to target but i know if i go to target i'm going to be spending a lot of money so whew, let's hope we don't have to go to target because your girl's gonna spend it back and i know it so um i do have some converse in my cart online for bryce and I really want to get him some Converse. I also want to get myself a pair of Converse. But if I can find some little cute, you know, play shoes in Walmart, I'll get him those. I'm not sure if I should go out and do my errands first and then content plan or if I should just go out. I mean, or if I should just stay in and then go out. But what makes the most sense? Like, just to go and get the errands over with while the store isn't packed? I think that's what I'm going to go ahead and do. So, yeah. First things first, um... My phone is on 79%. This charge is really fast. I'm probably going to let it charge up to about 89%, which is going to be like 10 minutes. And then that will give my camera battery time to charge too. And then we'll be on our way to the store. But until then, we can start on the content plan and I don't see why not. Also, y'all, this is the book I started a couple of days ago, Discover the Power Within You by Eric Butterworth. I read it already, but I want to read it again because I'm at a point in my spiritual journey where um i'm at that point like i was explaining to my other video i'm recognizing that i know a lot of stuff but i don't understand a lot of stuff so i need to find a way to keep myself and in my ego work journey too i need to find a way to keep myself grounded or have like that daily dose of not inspiration that daily dose of enlightenment you know so i can keep myself grounded i need like some values to go by every day of course i have my own values and philosophies about things but when you're in the world it's it's kind it's easy to apply that to yourself but it's not 
it's not as easy to apply that to the experiences that you have. So, you know, the way people treat you or the way you interact with people or the way, you know, situations you might end up in, it's easy to say, oh, I, Jemiah, am this person. You know, I'm patient, I'm kind, I'm this, I'm that. But when you go out into the world, you forget that because not everybody's on that same frequency as you. So you still are who you are, but when you interact with people, like you exchange the energies, you're absorbing the energies. And maybe it's an empath thing, but I don't know. But anyways, that's what I need help with. So this is why I read this again, because this is the feeling and the sense of direction this book gave me. So that's what I'm reading right now, y'all. It's not that long of a book, so fingers crossed that i finish it because i know i'm good for starting the book and i finish it so um yeah we about to get started on this content planning so yeah i don't have any youtube videos planned out at the moment so this vlog that i'm filming today and i also filmed the video starting my locks and that's going to be going up to well before this video so that's the content i have for youtube and i have to kind of um I gotta edit that one. I never started editing it. It's still on my camera. So, um, yeah, that's the YouTube content that I have. I'm drinking a protein shake that I made this morning after I worked out. Um, the workout that I did is the workout I did in my last vlog. So, my upper body workout that I do on Mondays. Um, so, yeah, go check that out if you want more information. If y'all want, I could do just like a, a week of workout workouts with me. So, y'all can see all the workouts I do because I, I do target different body parts on different days. So, I'm just gonna check my application right quick so yeah let me go look at my youtube channel also wait 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 hold on hold on hold on did y'all see my new intro did you see my new intro I, oh my god i made a new intro and i'm so in love with it i made a new intro i love it um i also updated my channel banner my channel art on youtube and i couldn't be happier i feel like it's so me like it's so perfect i'm so happy with it um, this will be my first video using it, so let me know what you think. Um, I'm probably not gonna put it in every video, but who knows? Like I say, I have to go in and figure out what kind of content I'm gonna do, but it's definitely gonna be used in like my vlog or lifestyle type videos. So, so yeah, let's get on to it. Like I said, I don't have any videos that are pre-recorded besides the lock video and this vlog that I'm filming now. So, let me get my journal out, and we're gonna start working on content for this week i usually don't even use a journal when i do my content planning i use that calendar and i use this whiteboard let me get it also i'm gonna show y'all my ootd all right got the whiteboard this chair so obnoxious so i have to get a couple of things from the store because i just realized using this wipe i gotta get some more wipes too so i blow a bag of dick <laughs> I don't do nothing from Gazy. Mom life. Just adult life, period. I might even want to say mom life. You be blowing that cash, you know. You just spend money. Just. Oh, just spend money. Just, just spending all the money, bro. And it's. It's a thing. It's a thing, but I ain't going to cap. It kind of makes me happy knowing that I'm able to take care of whatever I might need to. For my baby and for myself, you know. Not having to think about like, oh, where am I going to get the money to do this and that? Definitely blessed and I'm so thankful for it. But yeah, I worked out this morning. I'm just cleaning off this board. But yeah, my workout this morning was lit. Um, why do I still have these AirPods in? I feel like they're giving me a sense of like security. Um, but yeah, my workout this morning was so lit, bro. I I was so tired. My my alarm went off, but I still got up and I went out there and I worked out and. I feel amazing. I haven't worked out in about, um, I haven't worked out in about like a week and a half maybe. And I ain't gonna cap, I ain't gonna say I was beating myself over it, but beating myself up over it. But I was definitely battling with my inner thoughts about, you know, why I wasn't doing it. But I was extremely tired after I got off of my cycle. So I don't know what that was, but it happened and it's gone. And I worked out today and I feel amazing. And I look amazing too. This is not going to come off. Let me clean this. That did the trick for sure. Hello. Alright, so here we are. I got my whiteboard all cleaned up. Doing 22 content. You're a full-time content creator. I got my goal up there. 
um pretty self-explanatory now my goal is eight videos on youtube and 12 ig posts or two videos a week on youtube and three posts a week on instagram so um i do have plan content planned out for instagram like i said so for this is not really gonna be like you know specific you know posts or anything like that but i just want like i said i just want to get more clear on the direction i'm going to take my youtube channel i low-key just want to switch the youtube channel all the way to lifestyle content with that underlying wellness aspect so um let me so basically it's gonna be like giving y'all you know like my daily life but making it informative at the same time so it's gonna look like vlogs you know preparing for the week showing y'all my routines maybe like um my favorite vegetarian meals and things of that nature right so i'm just gonna write that down so i usually do my content planning like for the whole month but uh, i think i'm gonna go ahead and do it by the week this time that way i can write more stuff so for youtube I'm going to do, um, like I said, starting my locks. And then we're going to have the, um, what video is this? Prepare for the week with me. And, um, yeah. So those are going to be the videos I upload on YouTube this week. Upcoming, I'm just going to make a little note at the bottom for like upcoming video ideas that I could do. A uh, grocery shop with me or meal prep with me. And a life vlog. I'm just making that little note on the bottom. Maybe I could even do these, um on instagram or youtube so y'all i just finished planning my content i pretty much have everything laid out for the week i have my reel that i'm going to post and my two like regular posts for instagram and i'm probably i'm probably gonna upload a little extra content on ig this week because i do have a lot of content that i already like took you know i already filmed and got together for instagram but i never uploaded it because i want to well because i'm uploading like a specific time a, a specific amount of times per week but my content is just getting backed up at this point so i'm probably gonna upload more yeah this is just my youtube side starting my locks prep for the week with me which is today and this is like upcoming video ideas that i could do like on instagram like make it a real or you know i can make an actual youtube video out of it and i'm probably gonna make like half and half just so i can have some content but um yeah that's what i'm working on this week um content plan for the week okay Next is going to get some groceries for the rest of the week. Um, and I don't really need much. I'm just going to go get like a few like filling things. And I need like diapers and like things for Bryce and medicine and things of that nature. So yeah, my phone is only on 86%, but it's like, am I about to wait? No, because it's already about to be 11 a.m. So yeah, and I haven't really ate breakfast. All I have is my protein shake. So I'm going to go ahead and start these errands and then I'm going to see me. I'm taking the camera in the store and maybe I'm going to film myself putting the stuff in a basket. I just want y'all to see me outside of my house. Here is the OOTD. I know y'all can't really see, but cracks. Pink. Yeah, the parrots don't really match, but that's all right. Alrighty guys, so I'm in a car about to be on my way to this other Walmart. Hopefully they have everything I need here. I'm gonna see y'all when I get in there. Hi guys, I'm vlogging in the stove. Check me out. Um, I just made it to Walmart and um, yeah, it's packed in here. Y'all know I'm not like that yet, so I'm not gonna really vlog too much, but I'm gonna show y'all the stuff that I'm putting in my basket. Um, I'm in a baby aisle, I'm about to get Bryce some diapers. What, 148 in a box?
Okay, y'all, I just made it out of Walmart, and when I tell you I am anxious beyond measure, I'm anxious beyond measure. Um, first of all, all the lines were like backed up, so I had people waiting on me to scan my stuff, and I kind of wanted to like set my camera up and show y'all, but it's cool, I'm gonna get there, I'm not there yet, but I was super anxious because it was like a long line, and I kept fumbling, the bags wasn't right, and I was trying to like get everything together, make everything perfect, but I just kept making mistakes, you know, that's what my brain was telling me, oh, you're making mistakes, you're messing up right now, you make them people wait, they're waiting because all the lanes was closed, okay, so I have my things, as y'all saw, put my groceries up, right now I am hungry, it's 1 p.m., I'm happy, I'm so happy I came and got this out the way because I can't imagine coming, you know, to the store later, so um, once I get inside, I'm gonna put my groceries up and maybe start working on my other videos so I can have these two to go up this week, which is already the six. And also my contact's supposed to become a day, so maybe I can catch that package if they haven't already came. And uh, yeah, I got my bags and stuff. That was a successful trip. I wish I had a camera stand. I wonder if they sell those. I could probably just get something to stick my camera to and have it sit right there. I'm about to be on my way home. Probably gonna eat something that I just bought. Hope I'm gonna eat some of my possible nuggets. Those things are so good. I'm gonna show y'all the stuff I got for Bryce. I'm gonna probably just go ahead and get his Converse offline like I said I wanted to because they didn't really have any cute shoes in there, so. Oh, you must think you like that, huh? At the gas station, yo. Looking hot as mess. Looking wool out, I'm tired. Fill up my car, mm. Let me see. Let's see how much this one cost, y'all. Gas is 4.39. Just made it home, y'all. As you can see, it's a fly here. I don't know where it comes from, but uh, just made it home. I'm about to start putting these groceries and things up, and I'm also prepping some grease. I should have put it in the air fryer, but I'm about to make me some impossible nuggets and some fries. So that's how this about to go. I low key want to prep my pineapple to bring it upstairs in my refrigerator, but I'm really tired and I'm hungry. So I'm gonna just focus on getting whatever I can upstairs and putting whatever I can down here. In the refrigerator. So I'm about to give y'all a little run through of everything. Well, yeah. I'm about to give y'all a little run through of some of the stuff I got. Oh. Well, say hey to my vlog. Hey, hey, hey. Bye. Girl, you barely in the counter. I know. But um, I got some alkaline 15 pack water. Yeah, these are the 23 fluid ounce bottles. And then I got a six pack of the 33 fluid ounce, fluid ounce bottle. Got me some Moscato, Arbor Mist, uh, mango strawberry, a pineapple, some mustard. We got a bunch of bananas. I'm sorry if the grease is kind of loud. I can't really tell if it's like loud or not. But I got bright some clothes, which I'm gonna show y'all when we get upstairs. I got strawberries, blueberries, impossible nuggets. Two of them. French fries. 15. Got some almond milk. Got the smoked beef. Y'all don't know about these. Yeah. Yeah. Dry race mocha. Some random stuff. Dime tap. Baby lotion and body wash. Smoke a loop. Oh. Yes. I made it home. It is currently 1.59 on the dot. I'm about to eat my food. Mmm. Oh, impossible nuggets with french fries. You already know how the sauce is, how we get down with the sauce. Sweet and spicy barbecue, honey mustard. That's it, that's all. So yeah, I'm about to eat this food and I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos. I'm gonna see if Jayla upload. I know Maya been uploading daily. I'll get back with y'all and show y'all what I got for rice. Oh, it's about to go down. I'm back, y'all. Um, This clip is gonna be inserted like where it's supposed to be at, but this is way after the video has been filmed and finished. I realized that one of my clips, uh, I guess it got damaged when my camera went dead. So yeah, um, I'm refilming part of this video. And uh, yeah, I pretty much got to show y'all the stuff I bought for Bryce again, which ain't really much. And I really wanted to show him anyway. I just got him from school. So it ain't gonna be like I'm doing too much. So hold on, let me get the clothes. Look, say hi. Oh, you want to open the box? 
Okay. You won't wait. All right, I'm sitting on my full time right now. That's diapers. Uh, hey, 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 hey. We cannot color on it. Come, come. You don't color on it. Okay, so I'm just show y'all like how I got them, like an outfit form. But these are all like mix and match pieces or whatever. I got this set, this orange and gray gym shorts to go with this two piece tank top set. And this is like mix and match. Like I said, all of the pieces are mix and match besides the pajamas, but you get the picture. Um, this was five ninety eight for these two tees. These shorts I didn't find a tag on them, so I just rung up another item that I had for this, and it came up to four eighty eight. This shirt here, which was four forty eight, it says to go with these ombre blue shorts, which were four forty eight as well. I got him this colorful monster truck shirt to go with these gray camo fleece shorts. What you doing, Brace? You gotta close that other marker first. Let's put this one up, and then you can get another one. Put that one up. Good job. And then we have this red um, dirt bike boy shirt to go with these camouflage blue fleece shorts. Can't really see the colors but like this blue right there y'all heard what i see it's mixed and match lastly i got uh this little short shirt to go with these navy blue shorts but onto the pajamas i got him i got him this star red and blue and white set this was um 544 um i got this pajama set snacks before naps um this one was 544 again. I'm telling you, don't sleep on Walmart, girl. And then lastly, I got him this four-piece blue, orange, and blue, orange, and white set. Um, it comes with a shirt, like a t-shirt, and uh, some shorts, as well as a tank top with some pants. So this is real cute. I got all of his clothes in a two-t because after you wash Walmart's clothes one time, they shrink crazily, and Bryce is in like a 24 months, but. The 2T is going to shrink down and be his perfect size. But, um, yeah, those are the things I got from Walmart for him. Um, my total my ended up being with my food, 232 And just the clothes and all the other items I showed y'all came up to 173 Then I went and got some gas for $50. Girl, just spent a bit today, girl. Just $300 on a Monday afternoon. Like, what is this? You know, I don't have time for this. I can't do this no more. It's hard. But... Anyways, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Um, It was really fun. Nice meeting you. Thank you for preparing for my week with me. I have all my groceries I'm going to need for this week. I have my meals planned out and stuff like that. Um, Yeah, I did my errands pretty much. I probably won't have to go back to the store or the gas station at all the rest of this week. So, yeah, um, maybe in my next video I can do a little more things with y'all because I kind of already did do like... The cleaning part, washing clothes and stuff over the weekend. So maybe next week, we could get like the whole prepare for the week with me like starting on Saturday. So yeah, thank y'all for watching. This is like a mini prep for the week with me, you know, doing our hair and stuff like that. Like I'm going to take y'all through the whole journey next time. So yeah, either way, thank you for watching this video. This was, it was amazing. I went outside and vlogged for the first time and... I feel like a big girl. So, yeah. Um, thank y'all for watching this video. I'll see y'all in my next one.